Welcome back to the channel, everyone. It's great to have you here again with us. We really appreciate your support on our previous videos. It means a lot to us. Definitely. We appreciate any feedback you're willing to give us. That being said, each week we're looking to better ourselves, bring you new content, new videos, show the gear in the warehouse, and just show you our tips and tricks that we find along the way. So for those of you just tuning in, my name's Levi. I'm Colton. Today we've got a what's new video for you. So uh, from vendors like Mega Bass, um, Jackal, Daiwa. We've also got some important restocks as well from uh, Frisky Jenny Trolling Flies and uh, Rapala. So without further ado, let's do it. Alright everyone, our first restock is on the Frisky Jenny flies, trolling flies, okay? So all my trout guys out there, we got some uh, key colors back in, Perch, Demon, Natural, we got a Seahawk Glow, actually got a strip that uh, lights up. So, pretty sick flies, what, what do you do with those? You long line them, a lot of guys use them at Pond Array, and I've heard that the Demon color excels, where okay. the other ones just simply can't seal the deal. Cool, hear that? It's another tackle tip for you. Come get you some. Come get you some. <laughs> All right, so moving along, we've got the restock on the Moontail and the Neon Eye Jigs. We've got the Ounce, and these guys glow. You have to see them under the UV. Definitely. I mean, it's just a different Definitely. game. It really is. You can, we've got the, what is it, the Bad Dad's Jigs. Yep, and Burbit Bombs. The Burbit Bombs are killer. We've got that, we've got the Halogamide, Her Hel Hel Helgramite. Helgramite. We've got those guys. They glow. They simply work. You'll catch walleye, you'll catch burbit. In the same note, we've got these jigging wraps here, and we've had them before, but the difference with these guys is just the color. And what I want to try to show you is look at the color on that belly. Oh man. It just sticks out. And you've got time yet with the ice, it's thawing. You still got time. You could put a maggot on there if you want to add a little flavor flav to it. Definitely. I mean, what Drop else do you down think? There. Yeah. Um, great walleye bait. Definitely. Same with my walleye bait, you know. Definitely. Um, same with our snap wraps too. So that's a that's a huge portion of that. So awesome. So our first new product here, we've got uh, some swim baits. Okay, Savage Gear makes a ridiculous bluegill. This is the pulse tail bluegill. Okay, so realistic. The uh, the boot tail on the back, man, does it kick. So, dude, just looking at that profile, mm -hmm. the size of that thing matches our bluegill so well up here. I mean, see how that sits in my hand? Yep. I mean, yep. <laughs> and uh, they make two different styles. They make a top hook, like jig hook, and then they make a uh, weedless style as well. I believe they call that an ADOT. Um, so, yeah, they're, they're wicked baits. Fish them shallow, fish them deep. Deadly. The catch fish. Deadly. And in the same note, we have the bass killers. These things should be on the FBI watch list. Okay. So we've got our Kitex here. Yeah. We've got 3.8, the 3.3. But what you notice about that, Colton? Uh, a fire craw. Yeah. And this thing smokes them. It's not even funny. And not only that, we brought them in in the smaller version here. We've got the Easy Shiners. And these things dude, just kill. Dude, on a swim jig, lights out. Mm -hmm. Lights out. Springtime, if you're not fishing red, what are you doing? If you're not fishing red, you're dead. <laughs> if you're not fishing red, you're dead. <laughs> I mean, Kitex the name and catching bass is the game. And so what? You, you throw that out on that swim jig head, you said? Swim jigs, spinner baits. Uh, shoot, I mean, you could even put it on a quarter to half ounce uh, swim bait head, you know? Definitely. So... Awesome. I'm excited. Yeah. And not to mention, we also had a huge restock in Kitec. Mm -hmm. So all, almost all the colors are available. That it's we carry. stinking up the warehouse. I mean, <laughs> it is. Come down and get them while they're still here. <laughs> that squid scent. Please get them out of here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> all right. So for our next new products, we've got uh, the hard bait category. Okay. 
So from Megabass, we've got some brand new crankbaits. These are the Super Z Z3s. So if you're familiar with the Z1s and the Z2s, this is just the deeper version of them. Um, sick craw patterns in them. Super excited the green craw with the orange belly. I like that matte on there. Oh, matte craws, they just knock them dead. Mm -hmm. um, so those are gonna be fished. They say it's a uh, about 10 to 13 foot diver. Sure. So it's gonna hit perfect, perfect zone. Um, small mouth, large mouth. It's actually got their LBO system in it, which is their, uh, their casting system. So it's a three eight ounce bait, which seems light, but uh, the way it's weighted, it, you can zing it. You can throw it on casting gear for sure. Definitely get around some dogs with that. Yep. And whatnot. Yep. Cool. That's well, exciting, exciting offering from Mega Bass. Definitely. I'll be picking up a few myself. I already have. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I didn't see that color out. So now <laughs> I understand. So another exciting addition that we've got is we've got the Rearrange 110s made by Jackal. And these guys here, they're, I mean, they're just. Look at that. They're, perch. they're pretty. They're Ooh. pretty. And, you know, I mean, a little bit cheaper of a price point, but the idea here is I just was talking about wanting to get into jerk baits this season. What what was that rod you just picked up? I picked up the 611 jerk bait special oh, made yeah. by Mega Bass, the Bass. Levante line. And that guy, I mean, I'm I've got the reel that I'm gonna put on it that we're gonna talk about in just a little bit, so don't go anywhere. But I mean you know more about it. You were the one who sold me the rod, so. Sure. Short rod, I mean, it's it's a jerk bait special. So, softer tip on there with your backbone. Uh, really, really crisp, so you can get that action on the jerk baits. Um, yeah, it's <laughs> it's gonna be gonna be a wicked rod for you this year, man. Perfect for throwing one tens of any yep. any kind. Yep. Awesome. The uh, Stacy's Rearrange, Vision One Tens. I mean, all of them have a place. You Definitely, know? time and a place. Yep. The moment you've all been waiting for. We have got the Tatula SV Limited. Okay, this is a new one from Daiwa. These are just money. Okay, all aluminum frame on there, carbon handle, so smooth. Mm -hmm. They are the SV Spool. Yep. So longer distance, uh, less backlash. They got the T-wing system in there too. Um, what are you gonna use yours for? Mine's going on my chatterbait rod. Okay. Yep. All right. I uh, I'm actually putting uh, this Max Quattro that we got in. Mm -hmm. This is uh, 30 pound, and we also yeah, got 20. 20 pound that I think you're gonna be putting on yours, huh? Yeah, I think I'm gonna use this as my little uh, setup for the jerk baits. It is. And I'm gonna go with the 20. I like the lighter just to give it that crisp action. I sure. want it, you know, but I'm still gonna be tying the floral leader okay. so it still has that same action that it would otherwise. Sure. But I'm really looking forward to putting the brakes to the fish this season. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, I don't know how uh, this SV is gonna launch some chatterbaits, so. You know, where I launch them, I'm going to need to get them back. So that's why I'm going with the 30 pound. <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> so, does that wrap up our video? <laughs> Far be it, my friend. Oh. We have the most important delivery to date to this store. And might I add, we are the only place in town to carry Mega Bass rods. Bingo. So, without further ado, we've got in their destroyer line, their P5 line. And this guy happens to be called the Whippet. It's a spinning rod, 6'6". Six, six. It's F2 power, so it's going to be ultra light, pretty much. You're talking 30 second to quarter ounce. You're going to be finessing it. This thing is just unreal. I mean, it's beautifully done. It's, you can tell that they really took their time with this rod, and it's just a piece of of craftsmanship it's a piece of art honestly and i'm going to be considering putting one of these in my arsenal very soon definitely so definitely i mean you had to do it quick because uh 
I have a feeling it won't last long. Yeah, limited stock right now. Yes. I mean, these guys are not easy to get in. No, no they are not. So what do you got for us? So I've got two casting models here. We've got the blade and the tachyon shaft, okay? So basically they're spinnerbait, chatterbait version and they're um, Texas rig light punch version in the tachyon shaft. So the spinnerbait version, it's a 6.8, 3 eighths to 1 ounce. Mm -hmm. So you can do a lot with it. Um, it's got a little bit softer tip, but then the backbone hits right away. So mm -hmm. you get the accuracy on the casts, um, especially with the shorter length too. Um, as far as the tachyon shaft goes, that's a uh, six and a half power at six, seven quarter to ounce and a quarter. So like they describe it, um, light, light punching and Texas rig. I mean, bottom mm -hmm. contact is going to be awesome. The sensitivity of these rods is just ridiculous. I mean, mm -hmm. <laughs> it's outstanding, bro. You just have to feel it to understand you do. it. I yep. mean, words don't put it into yeah. any con comparison. And like like we said earlier, whether you like us or not, <laughs> you come in and get your hands on these things mm -hmm. um, because no one else in town has these, and they it is a piece of art. Yeah. So. And feel free to talk to us about it, but if not, they've started putting these little cards on there that have a wealth of knowledge that tell you all sorts about what you can do with the rod and everything in between. Yep. So it's really cool. Really helpful. All right, everyone. So fishing season's right around the corner. I'm stoked. I'm beyond stoked. We're going to get those P5s in our hands um, and start fishing those this year. So that'd be sweet. Definitely. Um, all the stuff we showed you today is applicable for this uh, upcoming season. So most of which is coming home with me tonight. <laughs> He's not even lying. <laughs> but uh, no, on a serious note, if you need it, get it. Product shortages are still a thing and they will continue throughout the year. So, you know, be mindful of that. Get the stuff that you're confident in and stock up. Definitely. And that being said, we just wanted to take a moment to thank each and every one of you that has shown support for the channel so far. We really appreciate it. Can't be doing it without each and every one of you. And each week we are looking to bring new content, better videos, and we hope that you'll stick around and share the news. And for those of you just tuning in, I'm Levi. I'm Colton. And we'll see you on the water.